Hey folks, this is Johnny. Welcome to another Home Studio Trainer Show. It's my third take on this now. Uh, today we're going to actually take a look at mixer scenes. So if you guys could, I'd really appreciate it if you're on YouTube. Uh, like and subscribe. If you're on Rumble, please hit the follow button. And if you uh, want to help out the channel, uh, you can actually go to Patreon and become a paid member over there. Lots of benefits over there and a lot of videos that I can't do here. So check that out. All right, let's go right to the classroom and we're going to take a look at mixer scenes. So I have this little song here. All right, so let's say the client wants a couple of different mixes. It wants a version without the acoustic guitar, and then it wants an instrumental version. This is where Mixer Scenes comes in. You go down to this button here. It says so, uh, Show Scenes. <laughs> there we go. So now you can actually choose what to include in all of your Mixer Scenes. So I'm actually going to include uh, all of the uh, choices above. Uh, let's see, I don't want selected channels, or I don't want to recall input channels, and I don't want to recall output channels. So we're just going to do these here. Visibility, insert, volume, sends, pans, cue mixes, mute, and input con uh, input controls. So that's going to pretty much pull up everything as I save these scenes. All right, so we want to do, the first thing we want to do is we want to do a main mix. So I'm going to hit the plus sign. <clears throat> and let's see main mix <clears throat> there so this one will always be here and be ready for me to be able to go back to so now i'm going to actually do a version without the vocal All right, perfect. So I'm gonna hit the plus sign and I'm going to say instrumental. Now I have two. All right, so now. <clears throat> so now I wanna do one with just the drums and the bass. So let's take the acoustic guitar out. There we go. So now I'm going to go and hit the plus sign and say drums and bass. All right. So now the cool thing about this I can actually shuttle between the different mixes uh, while it plays. That's pretty cool. Start it over, start it over, start it over again. Now, unfortunately, there's no automation mode for this. I'm sure a lot of you guys that are looking at this for the first time are going, oh, can I automate that? No, unfortunately, you can't. But what it does give you the ability to do is it gives you the ability to click through these and hit the mix down click the next one and hit the mix down and just get all of the mix downs uh, into uh, your mix down folder so that you have all of the different versions. The other thing that it gives you the ability to do if you're just practicing and testing on the fly, you can actually come up with different kinds of mixes and things like that to actually be able to test the song in different modes. So it's kind of, um, I wouldn't call it a scratch pad like you can't do it in the scratch pad, but if you get clever and you get fast enough at it, you can actually test different kinds of mixes mixes as you go so there you go that is mixer scenes uh, so i hope that you guys got something out of this and i will see you all in the next video